Do you personally know the people who come to your seminars or who watch your YouTube videos? Do I personally know them? Well, the very first time I meet them, no, I don't personally know them. It's like we go and deliver seminars at new locations all around the world. Most of the time I've never met those persons before, except when they come to my first seminar. Now, of course, there are many people who come to lots of seminars because they like what they hear. And as a result of that, over that period of time, I get to know them a bit. And sometimes then they invite us out to dinner or we go out to a meal together or we do something, you know, recreationally together. So I get to know them a bit more. And sometimes they invite us around to their home and sometimes we go. Not all the time because we can't go to everybody's home who invites us. And so after a while, we do get to know people who come along to our seminars. And sometimes because people have come along for many years, we obviously know them quite well as a result of that. So, but that is only the subsequent result of them coming to the first seminar generally. We generally do not know people who come to the first seminar they've ever been to um, before they come. Most of the people who come to our seminars we've never met before and we've never you know, done any kind of pre-organisation or some kind of pre-marketing to get that person to come to our seminar. So, so we have no real control over what happens with people or people's lives and we often get to know people through the process of sharing this divine truth that we're sharing with the world. We, because we enjoy that so much and we enjoy most of the people we meet, we do finish up developing many friends as a result of having this divine truth available and giving divine truth to the world and sharing it in the manner in which we do. So what's happened over a period of quite a number of years now is we've, we've had many new friendships develop as a result of firstly a person coming along to a seminar, then as they progress and grow, we find more and more that they, you know, we finish up spending a bit of time with them. If their desires and passions are very much along the lines of sharing divine truth with the world themselves, then often we spend more time with them as a result of that. And so we do get to know some of the people quite well and therefore become very good friends with them.